How are we doing? Nick from Beigeneers here and next up we've got a double IPA from St Ives Brewery. Don't know a lot about them. I've picked this up from the bottle shop in the centre of St Ives and this is Destination Dipper coming in at 8%. And on the back it says it's big, it's juicy, it's crushable and dank. Okay, we can only hope. Uh, and it's brewed with Galaxy, Citra, Amarillo, and HBC 630. Uh, and it's also got barley, wheat, and oats. Okay, so it's looking very promising. Never had this brewery before. Don't know anything about them. Um, while I've been here in St Ives, I've been hitting the, um, the Verdant. Because uh, it's a known quantity, and I know they're excellent, and I've been, I've been, it's been proven just how excellent they are since I've been here. Uh, so I've done four reviews of their beers, or four reviews of four of their beers. So enough faffing around. Let's pop the top, and let's see what we got. Okay, <clears throat> so it's a quite a dark. It's it's darker than the verdants I've been drinking this week slightly. Yeah, so it's like an orangey, hazy beer. There's half a finger of whitehead. Fast dissipating. Let's get the notes. I'm intrigued to see what we got. Never had one of these. Uh, the St Ives. Brewery beer before, so let's see. Okay, I'm getting a little bit of a little bit of fruit, a little bit of peach, a little bit of pineapple. I've just done a, a six point five normal IPA from Burden. There's noticeably less odour on this. Doesn't bode well this doesn't. Anyway, let's let's leave let's leave judgment um, until we know more. So let's go to the body and carb. Carbonation is crisp. Body is Body's light. Um, let's go for the big old taste. Chin chin. Okay, that's interesting. So there is a bit of fruit. There's not much, I've got to say. Um, comparatively, not much anyway. My palate's just battered from all the big juicy New England double IPAs, triple IPAs I've had, but noticeably, this is a double IPA, and there's significantly less sort of fruit coming off it than the Verdant uh, that I had earlier on. To be honest with you, if I had my eyes shut, I'd have said this was a West, I'd have said this is a West Coast IPA. Um, It is quite bitter and pine, piney in the back end. It's a brewed with. So we've got um, Galaxy Citra, so they're like New World, um, New England IPA type stuff. HBC, 630, don't know. Amarillo, I'm thinking that might be a, a West Coast IPA one. It's a memory. Chinook is one. I think Amarillo is, I think that's what's coming through. It says on the can, um, hops are Galaxy, Citra, Amarillo and HBC 630. If, I'm assuming that they are in quantities in accordance with that, but it didn't taste like it. Um, all I'm getting really is the Amarillo. 
Not for me, if I'm honest. I'm a fan of the, the New England, New World hops, big, juicy, grapefruit, passion fruit, mango, guava type thing. Um, I will drink a Westie, um, but they're, they're, they're second favourite to me. Don't understand that because it does look like a, a, a New England IPA. Um, yeah, so it, it looks the part, but there's just not the, the degree of New World hops that I, I, I crave. So, <clears throat> oh dear, first disappointment of the uh, of the week. What would I give this? Maybe, maybe I'm being harsh because of it's up against Verdant, and I've loved the Verdants I've had this week. Oh my God! If you look back on the other reviews I've done, look at the first one I did on fruit sidecar and I'm saying that's possibly the best dipper I've ever had up against those just absolutely kick the arse off this um, so sorry St Ives Brewery but you've got some work to do I'm afraid if you want to catch up on your uh, on your big brother Verdon you're not quite there yet but you know keep going in. So on that then, let's rate it. I'm going to rate this. So a little bit of sweetness, not much. Quite dry on the back end, which is nice, but I'm going to give this five and a half out of ten. Yeah, five and a half out of ten for Destination Dipper from St Ives Brewery. Would I buy again? Not for me. Um, but, you know, keep up the work and, you know, um, I'll, I'll try some Tyler's Brewery in the future when I'm, when I'm down in Cornwall again. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up if you like it. Thumbs down if you don't. I didn't really like this. If you, really like, if you do like this and you've had it, comment in the box. You know, happy to be corrected. Maybe it's because it's up against Verdance who are yeah, absolutely amazing. But uh, signing off, thanks. Cheers for watching. Bye for now.